People often ask me, what are some common things, Dean, that you coach people on? And I would have to say that I agree with a recent study by the Gallup organization around performance management that leaders these days, and I think it's due in part because we're just so busy and we have our own unconscious bias, are not very good, by and large, on setting clear expectations. I mean, think about the last time that you were dealing with one of your employees, or maybe even your child, or maybe even one of your friends or your spouse, and you got into a tiff, you got into a bit of an argument, and you're able to go back to the source of what started this whole thing. And I would bet a lot of it, or many times, it has to do with your view about expectations was different than the other person's. And this guy that I was talking to today, one of my coaching clients from a multinational company, was going into a description around a low-performing member of his team, around a particular project that he was expecting her to come through on. Well, as we got further into understanding what the project was and what he thought the expectations were, it was very, very clear that she had a completely different understanding about what success looked like. And I really think this is a common problem that we're seeing a lot. The Gallup organization talked about that. I see it every day with the coaching people that I deal with. And so in summary, I would really recommend that all of us seek for clarity versus perfection. And we really get the individual that we're setting the expectations with to be able to repeat back to us in a way that we know that they get it before we go ahead with any project.